uh, with that uh, we shall learn today um, the 15th lesson from our textbook panchadashaha paathaha navaratra mahotsavaha so the uh, conversation between two friends about the navaratri festival uh, how it how it is being celebrated at different parts of uh, our country bharata let us try to learn this uh, beautiful conversation and also see some of the grammar points and uh, peculiarities that are there and we shall uh, enjoy this lesson okay i shall call out uh, two students uh, priyadarshini bhagini and uh, jayshri bhagini please read out the sentences one by one that is mahesha and dinesh mahesha पंचदश पाठ नवरात्र महोत्सव महेश किं भो दिनेश बहुनि दिना बहुनि भवान क्रीडंतु नागच्छत एव कुत्र त्वम दिनेश दसरा दसरा विराम खलु अहम कोलकत्ता नगर ममाग्रजाया गृहमगछम Uttam, so I shall add uh, one more student. Um, uh, Amita Bhargava, please join the discussion. So now let us see. Let us try to understand uh, the sentences and try to um, get the meaning of this. So first thing, uh, Navaratra Mahotsava. Any sandhi in this word? Navaratra Maha Utsava. Very good. Very good. Maha Utsava. Mahotsava. is a guna sandhi utsavah is uh, basically a celebration or uh, um, uh, yeah it can be a celebration mahotsavah a grand celebration etc navaratra mahotsavah is the uh, grand celebration uh, during the navaratri okay something any other word to... for mahotsava in sanskrit um for mahotsavah okay uh, parva is another thing which you can say but uh, that means to say festival parva is another word that we will come across in the same lesson uh, moving forward we will be able to see and uttaha uttaha or ursa utsavaha utsavaha savaha sava also is one more word we can use ut is the upasarga that has been added to sava so um, navaratra savaha navaratra utsavaha uh, both of these we can use but utsava is something uh, kind of a more common um, uh, word that is being seen ganesh utsavaha etc right so utsava is basically a celebration that is the meaning of uh, this word okay let us try to see understand this kim bhoho dinesha he dinesha so this is uh, uh, sambodhana prathama bhakti so mahesha is calling out on dinesha and uh, saying hey how are you doing etc okay so kim bhoho dinesha this is uh, sambodhana prathama bhakti bhavantan drishtva bahuni dinani vyatitani so uh, similar to the previous lesson uh, what i want you to do is uh, you need uh, i request all of you to do the translations for these sentences these are simple and by now you should be in a position to kind of do the translation on your own but still uh, a few phrases and few words are given the meanings but not for each and every word okay so bahuni dinani vyatitani so vyatitani is basically it's an adjective to dinani and hence uh, uh, dinam vyatitam dinani vyatitani so it's a visheshana visheshana pada and hence it is following the same linga vibhakti and vachana of the word dinani okay bahuni is also in the same way bahuni dinani vyatitani both of, all these three words are, are related to each other and all based on dinani so um, many days have elapsed or many days have past uh, having seen you that is the meaning of this bhavantan drishtva bhavantam is bhavan shabda dvitiya bhakti hi ekavachanam ekavachanam okay uh, drishtva is which which kind of a word twa prati twanta abhyam very good twanta abhyam so having seen you so many days have passed having seen you that is the meaning of this uh, sentence bhavan kriditum nagachcha deva Uh, can you split the sandhi in this word? No, agachcha. Agachcha. Savarna dirka sandhi. Na agachcha deva. 
न अगछत एव ओके देयर आर टू संधिस हियर न अगछत एव अगछदेव इज कॉल्ड जस्तव संधि ओके व्हेन एवर द फर्स्ट लेटर ऑफ द वर्गीय व्यंजन क च ट त प इफ एनी वर्ड एंड्स विद द फर्स्ट फाइव लेटर्स ऑफ द वर्गीय व्यंजन एंड बिकॉज़ ऑफ द इन्फ्लुएंस ऑफ एनी स्वर ऑफ द सेकंड वर्ड ओके दैट इज हियर इन दिस केस इट इज एव ए ए कारा इज देयर और एनी मृदु व्यंजनम ओके इन दैट केस व्हाट विल हैपन द फर्स्ट लेटर विल बी चेंजिंग टू द थर्ड लेटर ऑफ द सेम वर्ग दिस संधि इज कॉल्ड जस्तव संधि डो नॉट वरी टू मच बिकॉज दिस जस्तव संधि एग्जांपल्स ऑफ मेनी इन इन आवर लेसंस दैट वी हैव लर्न्ड आई दैट्स व्हाई आई जस्ट ब्रीफली टोल्ड व्हाट व्हाट इज द रूल फॉर दिस जस्तव संधि द फर्स्ट लेटर ऑफ द वर्गीय व्यंजन changing to the third letter of the vargiya vyanjana if you just know this much it is sufficient for now to do any sandhi together so na agachat eva na agachadeva first is savarna dirga sandhi and next is chastra sandhi agachat uh, which uh, kriya padam it is langlakara langlakara prathama purusha langlakara prathama purusha ekavachana very good so since we are using bhavan bhavat shabda we are using prathama uh, this uh, prathama purusha ekavachanam so now if you see here in the second next sentence kutra agachha tvam this is also of the same lakara same dhatu but this is madhyama purusha ekavachanam because it is referring to tvam okay so whenever we use bhavan shabda bhavat shabda bhavadyoge na madhyamaha there is one rule which says bhavadyoge na madhyamaha so that is Uh, why when we use bhavat shabda do we are referring to you the, uh, that is probably the uh, second person or the person in front of us the kriya padam will be in prathama vibhakta prathama purusha only okay third kriditum person. it is always the third person that's what we have to yes, use it's always it is always third person for any other word except for tvam and uh, yushma shabda only when we use yushma shabda or intended use of yushma shabda we use madhyama purusha or when we use uttama purusha or intended use of uttama purusha we use uh, 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 you, uh sorry asma shabda we use uttama purusha okay yes kriditum can you identify the word tumunna avyaya tumunnanta avyaya very good kridati kriditum okay i uh, will proceed further for for that dinesh is replying dasara virama kalu so this is the vacation i mean um does uh, uh dasara vacation uh, is uh, this this time is the dasara vacation right so he is trying to tell that so khalu and kila and nanu these are some of the three words which are used like question tags uh isn't this the dasara vacation so that is how he is asking that question um dasara virama khalu this is or indeed this is dasara vacation and hence uh, so that is the next part of the sentence aham कोलकत्ता नगर्याम ममाग्रजाया गृहम अगच्छम अहम अगच्छम अहम कुत्र अगच्छम मम अग्रजाया गृहम अगच्छम मम अग्रजाया गृहम कुत्र अस्ति कोलकत्ता नगर नगर्याम अस्ति कोलकत्ता नगर्याम उत्तमम कोलकत्ता इति नाम नगर्याह नाम नगरी इज ईकारांत श्रीलिंग शब्द ओके so nagaryam will become saptami bhakti ekam achanam very good um and then mamagrajayaha sandhi shashti vibhakti ekavachana correct mama agrajayaha samandirga sandhi agraja meaning the elder sister anuja will be the younger sister okay um so this is shashti vibhakti ekavachana agraja aakaranta sthilinga shabda ग्रहम अगच्छम अगच्छम इस अगेन उत्तम पुरुष लंगलकार तृतीय उत्तम पुरुष लंगलकार का उत्तम पुरुष में उत्तम पुरुष एक वचन उत्तम धन्यवाद आह प्रेरणा भगिनी एंड प्रेरणा भगिनी थैंक यू धन्यवाद ओके विल गो टू द नेक्स्ट सेट ऑफ सेंटेंसेस कृष्ण मूर्ति महोदय एंड अमिता भार्गव प्लीज रीड द सेंटेंसेस वन बाय वन महेश 
नगरे नवरात्रि महोत्सवे दुर्गा पूजा विशेषतया आचरन्ति ताम दृष्टुम मम अग्रज आग्रह अकरोत अतः अहम माता पितृभ्याम सह आगच्छम अगच्छम अगच्छम ओके उत्तमम सीताराम महोदय प्लीज जॉइन द डिस्कशन okay we will try to understand these sentences uh, so mahesh is asking uh, why did you go now you could have gone during um, uh, the um, grishma virama during the summer vacation only right why why uh, like what was the reason that you went now that was that is what he is trying to ask okay kimartham idani meva agachha idani meva meaning now only okay idani is now eva whenever we use eva there are various um, in various uh, meanings we can use eva shabda based on the context we'll have to get the meaning of that word idani meva will become now only why did you go now only that is a question he is asking so here agachha is in uh, madhyama purusha ekavachan so tvam is something that we should uh, assume that is there okay bhavan kimartham idani meva agachhat would be the other way else tvam kimartham agachha so this is madhyama purusha ekavachan okay next grishma vasa grishma virame gantum shakshyasi khalu you could have also gone during summer vacation right so he is asking a question in that way grishma virame is it samasa grishma grishma yes um grishma virama yes so that, that it's a samasa samasa um so which vibhakti is in shashti vibhakti वेरी गुड शक्षसी is in dvitya ekavachana chakrabdatu madhyama purusha ekavachana tvam shakshasi khalu okay you could have also gone during the summer vacation right so that is what he is asking uh, as i said khalu and uh, uh, kila can be used as question tags right isn't it etc something like that okay so so that for that uh, dinesha is answering now no no uh, not like that tatra uh, कोलकत्ता नगरे तत्रा इज देयर इन कोलकत्ता कोलकत्ता नगरे अगेन सप्त विभक्ति एकवचन कोलकत्ता इज द वर्ड एंड नगरम नगरम इज नपुंसकलिंग शब्द इफ यू यूज नगरी दैट इज स्टीलिंग शब्द नगरम नगरी बोथ आर द सेम मीनिंग्स नगरी विल बिकम नगरियाम एंड नगरम विल बिकम नगरे सप्त विभक्ति डायरेक्टली केरे सेवन नगरे हैज टेकन द कोलकत्ता नगरे सो दैट इज व्हाई इट इज द महोत्सव Again, here this also is Saptavi Bhakti. One more question. What does what will happen in Kolkata during Navaratri? That is what he is trying to tell. Durga Puja, Visheshataya, Acharanti. So they celebrate this Durga festival or Durga Puja in a special way. Visheshataya. Okay. Uh, so that is that is what he is trying to answer. Durga Puja, Dutiya Bhakti. One more question. Visheshataya. Can you identify the vibhakti? Three linga ha. Very good. Visheshata. Yeah, visheshata is the word, and the third vibhakti, one word of that is visheshata. Ya, acharanti. Acharanti nama janah acharanti. Okay, that is the assumed thing, and it is pratham purusha bhagavatam. Bhagavatam. This is I is upasarga. Correct. I is upasarga. I upasarga sahita. 
chara dhatu aacharanti means they celebrate that is the meaning of uh, of this word okay tam drashtum tam uh, do, uh, can you identify what what is tam referring to avrotra mahotsav durga puja very good tam is referring to durga puja because tam is stealing a shabda we'll have to see which other word in the previous sentence was a stealing a word and uh, uh, if it is making uh, sense with respect to that so tam drashtum tam durga pujam drashtum so dvitiya bhakti ekavachanam drashtum drishthatoh tumananta avyayam mama agraja mama agraja agraham akarot agraham is to insist okay um uh, uh, agrahah can be also force uh, or it can be also insist uh, these are the uh, other word, meanings that we can have so my my sister in, insisted us to come to kolkata to um see or take part in this durga puja and navaratra utsava at kolkata so agraham akarot akarot prathama purusha ekavachanam agraja nanglakar avichinam ataha aham agacham kena saha agacham mata pitrubhyam pitrubhyam saha very good mata pitrubhyam saha mata pitrubhyam so this is tritya vibhakti tritya vibhakti divachana very good tritya vibhakti divachanam because we are referring to both uh, mother and father mata pitrubhyam saha whenever we use saha sakam sartham samam the corresponding word will be in tritya vibhakti and so here it is uh, this mata pitrubhyam so aham agacham okay so or we can also say one more way maya saha maya saha okay if, if you want to tell uh, instead of mata pitrubhyam saha aham agacham i want to uh, slightly change the sentence and tell um, i went um, sorry um, uh, i i went along with my parents okay uh, uh, how how would you change it mata pitarau mata pitarau agacham are ag अगछता mata pitaro will become the subject subject of that action that is right okay so like this so try try to do this kind of transformations in the sentences that we have seen and come across so that is where uh, uh, because we will have to change the kriya padam from uttama purusha to prathama purusha because mata pitaro and then vivachana so that is when we will be able to get some uh, uh, confidence in in kind of making sentences okay so dhanyavada um, amita bhargava and uh, krishnamurthy mahodaya uh, sitaram mahodaya you can read the next sentences i'll just change the slide okay yeah makeshaha tatra navaratra parva katham aacharanti yuyam kim kim apashyata uttamam i'll ask one more student to join um Krishna Prasad Mohanya, please read the next sentence. Dinesha, I am Utsava. Dasha Dasha Dinaanani Yavat Prachalati Prachalati. Ataha idam parva Dasha Dasha Har Dasha Dasha Hara Atava Dasara Ityapi Prasiddham Ityapi Ityapi Prasiddham Adi 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 Shaktehe. महाकाली Uh, dinesha would say and then he will also ask one more question yuyam kim kim apashyata what all did you see there see. okay so kim apashyata what did you see kim kim what all did you see okay that is how uh, the dvirukti of the uh, repeating the same word 
skim uh, again will add to that what all okay um anyat kim apashyata if you ask in that way what else did you see okay anyat kim so what else kim kim what all okay that's how uh, by just changing of one word we, the meaning of the uh, the sentence also can uh, change now tatra tatra is again an avyaya navaratra parva so parva is um nakaranta shabda nakaranta napumsika linga shabda similar to karma shabda karma karmani karmani the same way parva is also the same way karma parva parvani parvani and hence there is no visarga or anything even in mahabharata if you know the names of the chapters uh, is called parva okay so uh, adi parva sabha parva etc so it is not adi parva or sabha parva it is parva is an apumsika linga shabda okay just note that that should be sufficient navaratra parva how do they celebrate this festival navaratra parva that is what he is asking katham aacharanti aacharanti is janaha katham aacharanti so it is prathama purusha bahu vachanam next uyam tvam yuvam uyam it's again prathama purusha bahu vachanam uyam matyam apashyata apashyata bahu vachanam madhyama purusha bahu vachanam madhyama purusha bahu vachanam very good so it's madhyama purusha bahu vachana of drish dhatu that is pashyati of that langlakara apashyat apashyatam apashyan apashyah apashyatam apashyata okay uyam apashyata uyam for that madhyama purusha bahu vachanam uyam yeah it is prathama purusha bahu vachana i i marked it here 1.3 uyam madhyama purusha uyam is uh, um, prathama bhakti hi right so it's not madhyama purusha bhakti prathama bhakti okay from uyam uyam So that's right okay ayam utsavah ayam uh, is idam shabda this. so utsava is a pulinga and hence this this festival that is what it is meaning so this is all in prathama bhakti ekavachanam dasha dinani yavat uh, prachalati prachalati is this is being celebrated or proceeded or anything like that we can uh, use um dasha dinani yavat yavat is till 10 days or something like that that is what it means दश दिन प्रचलति सो दिस दिस ओके दश दिन प्रचलति या इट इज़ नवम सकलिंग ओके दश दिन सो इट कैन बी दश स्पेस दिन ऑल्सो दस नो प्रॉब्लम विद प्रचलति प्रचलति प्र उपसर्ग सहित चल धातु चल लक्षकार प्रथम पुरुष Ataha idam parva because of this reason why uh, since it is being celebrated for ten days this festival idam parva idam again it is nabum sekalinga of uh, idam shabda idam parva dasha hara athava dasara ityapi prasiddham ityapi any sandhi yang sapi very good iti plus sapi ityapi yang sandhi prasiddham prasiddham asti uh, you can assume that kriya padam Prasiddham means famous. Okay, Navaratra Parva is Navaratra festival or Navaratri festival, and uh, Dasha Hara. So uh, Aha Ha in in general Aha means uh, a day in in Sanskrit. Uh, aha Ha. Okay, you 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 would have um, 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 you would have Navaha Ha. You would have heard the word Navaha Navaha Parayanam Sapta Ha Ha a week, right? Sapta Aha Ha Aha means basically a day. So Dasha Hara. so it is being derived um, from that word and it is 10 days that is what it means dashahara or dasara a simplified version of dashahara is dasara based on the regional influence so ityapi prasiddham adi shaktehe trini roopani santi adi shaktehe adi shakti hi ikarantah stilingah shabdah or adi shakti which is shashti bhakti hi ek vachanam trini roopani santi how many roopas are there Three forms are there. Three ni. So this uh, both of these are in Prathama Purusha. Uh, sorry, Prathama Bhakti Bahu Achanam and Santi is Prathama Purusha Bahu Achanam. Okay. Okay. Asti staha Santi. Mahakali Mahalakshmi hi Mahasaraswati Cheti Santi. Uh, Very good. Cha plus Cheti Cheti Guna Santi. So these are the um, uh, three forms of Adi Shakti, uh, which are there. महाकाली महालक्ष्मी ही एंड महासरस्वती ओके
So uh, we shall see what uh, what more he will answer uh, in the next uh, slide. Thaniwada ha, Sita Raman Mahadeya and uh, Krishna Prasad Mahadeya. Dhati Bhagini, please read the next sentences. Asmin Utsave Adho Dhinatre Mahakalya Ha Pooja. Madhye Dhinatre Mahalakshmya Ha Pooja. Ante Dhinatre Mahasaraswatya Ha Cha Pooja Parjilati. Dashamyam Vijayatra Bhavati. Tatra Kalakatta Nagare Devya Ha Vividarupana Vigrahan Nirmaya Pratishtapya Cha Vaibhavena Janti. Very good. I'll call one more student. Uh, Aruna Bhagini, please join the discussion. Asmin Utsave, he is continuing. In this festival, Asmin Utsave, both these words are in Saptami Bhakti Ekavachanam. Okay, Adau. Adau is also Saptami Bhakti Ekavachanam, Adi Shabda. Okay, Dinatraye, Adau Dinatraye. So during the first three days, okay, Trini Dinani and Trayanam Dinana. Samaharaha. So the same way we had seen seen this word, uh, similar word in the previous lesson, like uh, uh, Sarovara Dvayam. Okay. So uh, kindly make note of this. Uh, probably I had told that uh, Sarovara Dvayam will become an Avyaya. Uh, it, it was uh, I was wrong in saying so. Sarovara Dvayam, the grammar, grammar, uh, grammatical peculiarity is that, so it is kind of a group. And we will be using the Ekavachana form always. So it will become a Napumsakalinga and Ekavachana. So Dinatrayam, Dinatrayam, then uh, Dinatrayena, then Dinatrayaya, etc. That's how it will become like an Akaranta, Napumsakalinga Shabda, Vana Shabda, having only the Ekavachana forms. Because we are referring to it as a group, okay, or a set. So that is why Dinatrayam and Dinatraye, the Saptami Bhakti Ekavachanam here also. During the first three days, okay, what, what is done? Mahakalyaha puja kriyate, okay, acharanti or prachalati, whatever, okay, and next, madhye dinatri, during the middle three days or next three days, the Mahalakshmiyaha puja bhavati, and then ante dinatri, during the end or the last three days, Mahasaraswatyaha cha puja prachalati. So, puja prachalati, kasyaha puja prachalati. Mahakalyaha, Mahalakshmiyaha, Mahasarswatyaha, Cha Puja Prachalati. Kada Kada Tesham, Athava Tasam Puja Prachalati. If you ask a question, Adho Dinatraye, Mahakalyaha Puja, Madhye Dinatraye, Mahalakshmiyaha, and so on. That, that will be the answer. Mahakalyaha, Mahalakshmiyaha, Mahasarswatyaha. All these three words are in which you have seen. Very good. Bhakti, Ekavacharam, Kali, Lakshmi, Lakshmihi and Saraswati. Okay, all these three are Ekaranta Shabdas. Okay, so, um, so it's also in Shashti Bhakti, Ekavacharam and then this also. Okay, and similarly, Dinatraye is uh, Madhye, Ante, all these are in Saptami Bhakti, Ekavacharam. Puja, Prachalati. Puja is Pratima Bhakti, Ekavacharam uh, and then Prachalati uh, is Praupasarga Sahita Chaladhatu Pratama Purusha Ekavachana. Okay, next. Dashamyam Vijaya Yatra Bhavati. Dashamyam, Dashami, that is on the 10th day. Okay, Dashami, Ekaranta Stilling Shabda. Dashamyam is Vijaya Yatra Bhavati. The procession, Yatra is basically a procession we can uh, take uh, based on this uh, uh, context uh, to celebrate the victory will take place. That is the meaning of this sentence. Dashamyam vijaya yatra bhavati. Pratma bhakti ekvachanam. Tatra kolakatta nagare kim bhavati devyaha vividha rupanam vigrahan nirmaya pratishthapyacha vaibhavenar chanti. Vaibhavenar chanti. Can you identify any sandhi here? Savatna dhukhya. Archanti. Vaibhavena archanti. What could it mean? Salvana Rigasandhi. Yeah, what could it mean? Vaibhavena Archanti. What is the meaning of this word? Vaibhavena Archanti. Celebrate with Vaibhava. Very good. What is Vaibhava? That's what I mean. As Vaibhava means grandeur. Okay. Grandeur. Yeah, or with um, 
or splendor or anything like that so very in a in a grand way they celebrate it vaibhavena archanti um kim archanti katham archanti if you ask a question vividha rupanam devyah vividha rupanam vigrahan nirmaya having built or uh, uh, created various forms of the devi or by by uh, sculpting by carving out whatever uh, what you want to use you can use um uh, so by by creating such different forms of devi that is veena pani sharada or hamsa vahini uh, saraswati in this way uh, or gajalakshmi and so on with, with various forms they they will uh, create different um, vigrahas of devi and they will do the celebration or they will do the puja they worship with grandeur that's the meaning of this nirmaya and pratishthapya all these words are yeah. um nirmaya is lepantavyam pratishthapya is also lepantavyam both lepantavya okay so vividha rupanam uh, which vibhakti shashti shashti bahuvachanam very good shashti vibhakti hi bahuvachanam devyaha shashti vibhakti bahuvachanam धन्यवाद Okay, Aruna Bhagini, read the next sentence. Um, okay. <coughs> Mahishaha, Karnataka, Karnataka Shwapi, Ayam Utsavaha, Acha, Acha Diyati, Utsavayam, Navaratro Utsavaha, Utsavoyam, Utsavoyam, Navaratro Utsavaha, Dashahara, Dasareti, Namna Akhyataha, Eshu Dineshu Deviyaha Pooja Prachalati. दशमी दिनी आचर्य विजयोत्सव जैत्र यात्रा प्रसिद्धस्ते मैसूर नगर मैसूर नगर प्रचार जैत्र यात्रा द्रष्टु देश विदेश सहस्रश जना आगछति उत्तम अन्नपूर्णा भगिनी प्लीज जॉइन डिस्कशन कर्नाटक विचंधि What is the sandhi, Aruna Bhagini? Uh, um, Karna. Stutva sandhi? No, it is a very common sandhi that you have seen. Yen, have yen, yen sandhi? Yes, yen sandhi. Arun Mohriya, please join the discussion as well. Uh, Karna takeshu api, yen sandhi. Okay, Karna takeshu, that, what does that mean is, even in regions in Karnataka, or in parts of Karnataka, because Bahuachanam is used, It, in various parts of karnataka that is what uh, it means by uh, karnatakeshu okay uh, ayam utsavah acharyate janaihi acharyate okay so acharyate is basically the passive voice form of acharati okay utsavah janaha acharanti utsavah janaihi acharyate janaha utsavam acharanti उत्सव जन आचर्य जस्ट नोट दट इट इज बिकॉज आचरती इज धातु इट हेज बिकम आचर्य इज एडेड एंड इट हेज बीन चेंज टू आत्मने पदी दिस इज वन वे टू ऐडेंटिफाई दट द सेंटेन्स इज स्ट्रांगली इन पैसिव वॉइस ओके लेट इज नॉट वरी टू मच एट दिस पॉइंट इन टाइम अबउट एक्टिव वॉइस एंड पैसिव वॉइस जस्ट नोट दट सम ऑफ द सेंटेन्स वेन आई वेन आई से दट इट्स इन पैसिव वॉइस जस्ट ट्राई टू अंडरस्टैंड Okay. Sorry, so is it bahuvachanam uh, acharyate? No, acharyate is ekavachanam only. Similar to lavate, acharyate, acharyate, acharyante. So utsavah. So uh, in passive voice, what will happen? Uh, uh, good question. Uh, I will try to answer uh, with a bit more detail. So acharyate is following utsavah. So if it is like utsavah, for example, then utsavah acharyante. That's how it will become. So usually. 
uh, irrespective of uh, whether it is in passive voice or in active voice um, the kriya pada will follow the word that is there in prathama bhakti okay so that is one hint i am giving you so since it is utsavaha it is ekavachana so that that way also we can try to understand it prathama purusha ekavachana and utsavaha is also prathama purusha uh, prathama bhakti ekavachana karnatakeshu saptami bhakti bahuvachana okay next utsavoyam any sandhi नवरात्र so that is uh, gunasandhi um uh, utsavoyam utsavaha ayam utsavaha navaratrotsavaha dashahara dasareti namna khyataha this utsava is famous khyataha is famous or known as well known as either navaratra navaratrotsava or dashahara or dasara okay dasara iti dasareti is again here also it's gunasandhi okay namna khyataha by these names by this name. it is famous or well known with this name or in this name okay next eshu dineshu during these days that is during these uh, 10 days or uh, the 9 days eshu dineshu uh, so it is saptami bhakti bahuvachanam dineshu is also same way saptami bahuvachanam devyah puja prachalati devyah ऑफ देवी सृष्टि प्रति एक वचन पूजा प्रचलति प्रचलति प्रथम पुरुष एक वचन ओके नेक्स्ट दशमे दिने व्हाट विल हैपन ऑन द 10th डे दशमा दशमाह दिनः दिनम और दशम दशमम दिनम दशमे दिने सप्तमे भक्ति एक वचनम ओके आचार्य मानः विजयोत्सवः चैत्र यात्रा इति प्रसिद्धोस्ति प्रसिद्धः अस्ति प्रसिद्धोस्ति अगेन हियर आल्सो इट इज पूर्व रूप संधि Uh, and visarga sandhi is there uh, anyway before that okay aacharya manaha aacharya manaha is basically a present continuous tense okay present continuous which is being celebrated okay aacharya manaha okay so that which is being celebrated vijayotsavah so on the 10th day the vijayotsava is being celebrated okay and that is also known as or that is very famous as chaitra yatra jaitra jaitra the word if, if you can understand jayati from that it is derived okay jayati is basically to uh, win or something or the victory so jaitra means something related to victory vijaya yatra or jaitra yatra mean the same okay it is prasiddha asti so here we are referring to utsavah okay since utsava is a pulling shabda okay uh this prasiddha is used and which is also in pullinga okay prathama purusha ekavachana sorry prathama bhakti ekavachana suppose say it was not uh, vijaya parva suppose we want to use tapumsa kalinga word here uh, vijaya parva chaitra yatra iti prasiddham asti parva prasiddham asti okay and if it is utsavah pullinga it becomes prasiddha asti suppose say we have a sthilinga shabda there puja vijaya puja i'm just giving uh, as an example then uh, what will be the change here dash asti prasiddha asti prasiddha asti okay so that's how uh, we will have to understand it okay very good so we'll proceed further mysuru nagare in mysuru uh, in in a place or in the city of mysuru the heritage city of uh, the karnataka prachalyamanam again prachalyamanam is also present continuous okay which is being proceeding or which is uh, uh, being proceeded etc um proceedings of this festival or any of these uh, artha we can take it prachalyamanam jaitra yatram drashtum desha videsha tah sahasra shah janah aagachanti so aagachanti janah aagachanti is prathama purusha bahuvachanam kutah aagachanti from where do they come desha videsha tah desha videsha tah so desha videsha tah is an avyaya now because of tah being added but it gives the meaning of panchami vibhakti from, from this country and abroad 
from foreign and from various from all the countries. That's what we can understand. So Pratalya Manam Deitra Yatram. So Pratalya Mana is a shabda, Akaranta stealing a shabda, and it is an adjective to Deitra Yatra. So both of these are in which we have the Dvitiya Dvitiya Ekavacharam. Very good. Dvitiya Bhakti Ekavacharam. Drashtum. Very good. Sahasra Shaha Janaha. Agachanti. Again, Sahasra Shaha. So uh, come in thousands. People come in thousands. Thousands of people come. That is the meaning here. This is Pratama Bhakti Bahuachanam. On this slide, we have seen two words which are actually the present continuous. That is Acharya Manaha and Prachalya Manaha. Now, uh, Acharya Manaha is because it is referring to Vijayot Savaha. Okay? And hence it is Pullinga. Now, if you are referring to stealing, then it would have become Acharya Mana. And if it is Nabumsakalinga? Acharya Manam. Very good. Acharya Manam. So, whenever you see this Ana, Ana, okay, Prachalya Mana, the, towards the end you can hear the word Ana. This particular this set of words are called Shanach. Uh, pratyaya in uh, it's a kridanta kridanta word this is based on the kridanta shanach is the pratyaya that gets added and that is used for the present continuous tense okay it is like something which i will not say present i will just say continuous because if you use abhavat or any kriya for them then it will become the meaning will be in the past tense okay but but this will give meaning of continuous something that is happening uh, now uh, happening in, in a continuous fashion. Okay, and then uh, it will be in Pullinga, Srilinga, and Apumsakalinga. In uh, it, it will be it will follow the words like Rama, Sita, and Vana. That is the simple thing that we can understand. Acharya Yakar, there is a repha that is there. Because of that, this has changed to Nakara. So whenever, uh, always we should remember is whenever there is repha or we have shakara, okay, murdhanya shakara in the word, based on other also there are a few grammar rules, uh, like I mean it should not be followed by certain letters or it can be followed by certain letters and so on. Most of the cases, if these two letters are there, the nakara that is part of the either either the shabda rupani or the kridanta pratyas anything will be changed to nakara. So that is why here it's Acharya Manaha and here it is Prachalya Mana. Okay, that, that is the difference. Okay, I hope it's clear now. Uh, we should proceed further. Ram Ram Mahadev. Anapurna, sorry, Aruna Bhagin. Okay, um, so next, um, Arun Mahadev and um, Anapurna Bhagini, please read. Dineshaha Kasya Vijayaha. Kimartham Acharante Maheshaha Pura Maheshaha Pura Mahesha Suraha Nama Praja Pida Kaha Rakshasaha Asid Tena Kritam Pidam Asahamana Hadevaha Brahma Vishnu Brahma Vishnu Maheshwaran Prathayanta Putam. Now let us understand this. Kasya Vijayaha. So now in the previous one, it said that Vijayot Savaha. Right? So uh, what, what? whose victory is it? Kasya Vijayaha. Okay. So Pratama Pratama Bhakti Kavachanam. Kasya Shishti Kavachanam. Yes, okay. So he is asking a question. Whose victory is it? Kimartham Acharanti. Why do they celebrate it? Kimartham. Why uh, celebrate Acharanti? Why do they celebrate Pratama Purusha? Uh, so, Janaha, Kimartham Janaha Acharanti, that is the intended meaning here. Mahesha will answer to that. Pura, once upon a time, or um, uh, once in uh, once, Mahisha Suraha Nama Praja Pidakaha Rakshasaha Asit. Mahisha Suraha Nama. So, the name of the, name of the demon is Mahisha Sura Nama Praja Pidakaha. Praja Pidakaha, what is the meaning of this word? Mm -hmm. There are two words in this, Praja and Pidaka. Okay, Pidakaha. Pida, pidayati. Okay, Prajan, uh, Prajaha Pidayati. That is the meaning. Okay, one who, one who troubles or tortures the citizens or tortures the people. That is the meaning of uh, this. 
word prajapidakaha. Prajapidakaha is an adjective to Mahishasuraha. Okay. Rakshasaha, Prajapidakaha, Mahishasuraha. All these are adjectives. It's on Pradamavati Ekavachanam. Asit, Langlakara, Pradama Purusha Ekavachanam. Okay. Tena, Kritam, Pidam, Asahamanaha, Devaha, Pramha Vishnu Maheshwaran, Prarthayanta. Tena, so Mahishasurena. Okay. By him, by the Mahishasura, Kritam, Pidam. ಪ್ರಥಮ unable to or uh, uh, tolerate that is the meaning of uh, this okay uh, devaha all the gods uh, uh, devaha um, prathama bhakti bahuvachana yes prathama bhakti bahuvachana brahma vishnu maheshwaran prarthayanta they they went to brahma vishnu maheshwara and they worship them or they pray to them <coughs> to help them from uh, this mahishasura okay so this this entire story is being narrated in one of the granthas that is the um, uh, durga saptashati which which is part of the markandeya purana okay so um, so that is uh, that will give the complete uh, story of what happened and how uh, this devi adishakti took various forms in in the in the rupa of lakshmi um, mahakali mahalakshmi mahasaraswati and how she killed various demons uh, so that is a beautiful narration that is there in the stotra format so that we can uh, refer to anyway so brahma vishnu maheshwaran is vidya bhakti bahuvachanam brahma cha vishnu cha maheshwaraha cha brahma vishnu maheshwaraha okay and now that is the uh, pratiparika brahma vishnu maheshwara and then it is always in the bahuvachanam brahma vishnu maheshwaraha the vidya bhakti will become brahma vishnu maheshwaral okay prarthayanta which uh, kriya pram is this prarthayate pra upasarga sahita pra upasarga sahita artha ah arthayate okay prarthayate so of that it is langlakara okay prarthayanta okay langlakara prathama purusha bahuvachanam devah prarthayanta okay hope all these words are uh, clear um dhanyavada hana puna bhakti en arun mahodaya dhanyavada hana ಸರ್ ಒನ್ ಡೌಟ್ ಇದೆ ಹಾ ಸರ್ ಇನ್ ಫಸ್ಟ್ ಸ್ಲೈಡ್ ಭವಾನ್ ಕ್ರೀಡಿತ ನಾಗಚ್ಚ ದೇವ ಸರ್ ಅದು ನ ಆಗಚ್ಚ ದೇವ ನ ಅಗಚ್ಚ ದೇವ ನ ಆಗಚ್ಚ ದೇವ ಸೊ ಯಾ ಬೋತ್ ವೇಸ್ ಇಟ್ ಇಟ್ ಕ್ಯಾನ್ ಬಿ देयर ಸೊ देयर ಇಟ್ ಇಟ್ ವಿಲ್ ಬಿ ಆಗಚ್ಚ ದೇವ ಸಾರಿ ಐ ಪ್ರಾಬ್ಲಮ್ ಇಸ್ ನ ಅಗಚ್ಚ ಪ್ರಾಬ್ಲಮ್ ಇಟ್ ದಟ್ಸ್ ವಾಟ್ ಐ ಪುಟ್ ಯು ಡಿಡ್ ನಾಟ್ ಕಮ್ ಟು ಪ್ಲೇ ಸೊ ನ ಆಗಚ್ಚ ದಟ್ ಇಸ್ ಅಗೇನ್ ಆ ಉಪಸರ್ಗ ಸಹಿತ ಆಗಚ್ಚ thank you right dhanyavada thanks for bringing it up uttamam so we shall proceed further and see what what text is there um uh, those who have not got a chance please raise your hand so that i can call out your names uh, satyajit mahodaya please read out the next sentence namo namaha namo namaha namaste namaste please shri murti naam ಮಹಿಷಾಸುರೇನ ಸಹ ಘಟನಾಥವರಾತ್ರೋತ್ಸವ ಆಚರಂತಿ ದಶಮ ದೀನೆ ವಿಜಯೋತ್ಸವ ಆಚರಂತಿ ದಶಮೇ ದಿನ 
विनोत्सव आचरन्ति उत्तमम ओके उदित कृष्णन महोदय जॉइन द डिस्कशन एंड आल्सो के के गुप्ता महोदय प्लीज जॉइन द डिस्कशन लेट्स ट्राई टू अंडरस्टैंड दीस सेंटेंसेस कंटिन्यूइंग टू टेल फर्दर व्हाट व्हाट इज हु इज व्हाट इज विजय एंड व्हाट हैपन सो ऑल द गॉड्स वेंट टू ब्रह्मा विष्णु महेश्वरा एंड दे प्रेड टू हेल्प देम फ्रॉम दिस ट्रबल दैट दे वर एक्सपीरियंसिंग फ्रॉम दिस महिषासुरा सो देन व्हाट हैपेंस um they will uh, they will all think they will see who can actually uh, kill this demon mahishasura and then trimurtinam itaresham cha devanam amshaihi sammilitaihi bhagavati durga devi avirbhuta okay so based on or because of um uh, the amsha amsha is basically uh, the inheritance or having taking some portion of the power or uh the um characteristic of each of the deities or each of the gods durga devi avirbhuta so how was durga devi came into existence if you ask a question because of the combination of all the powers of all the gods okay that is how it is amshaihi sammilitaihi so amshaihi sammilitaihi is uh, both of these are in kritya bhakti hi bahuvachanam okay hmm. त्रिमूर्तीनाम अंशैः इतरेषां च देवानां इतरेषां दट इज अदर्स नॉट जस्ट दीस थ्री ब्रह्म विष्णु महेश्वरा ब्रह्म विष्णु महेश्वरा इंद्र अग्नि वायु सूर्य यम एक्सेट्रा ऑल सो अगेन एज आई मेंशन इफ वी गो थ्रू दिस दुर्गा सप्तशती इट कम्स व्हाट पर्टिकुलर कैरेक्टरिस्टिक फ्रॉम व्हिच गॉड वाज कंसीडर्ड एंड 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 इट वाज यूज्ड टू um a uh, bring in durga devi into existence okay so trimurti naam itaresham both of these are in which vibhakti can you identify udit brahma vishnu sek tritiya vibhakti ek no, vachan it is shashti shashti bahu vachanam vachanam oh. trimurti naam itaresham all these are in uh, shashti vibhakti bahu vachanam devata naam again it's also in shashti bahu vachanam सम्मिलितैहि इज अगेन तृतीय विभक्ति बहुवचनम भगवति दुर्गा देवी आविर्भूता ऑल दिस आर इन प्रथम विभक्ति एकवचन प्रथम एकवचन आविर्भूता इज बिकॉज इट इज त्रिलिंग दुर्गा देवी आविर्भूता गणेशः फॉर एग्जांपल इफ इट इज पुलिंग अ शब्द इट विल बिकम आविर्भूतः ओके जस्ट नोट दैट चेंज इफ इफ इट इज पुलिंग और नपुंसकलिंग नपुंसकलिंग मित्रम आविर्भूतम दैट्स हाउ इट वुड बी ओके नेक्स्ट सा देवी सा दुर्गा देवी सिंह सिंहारूढ़ Yes. So it is Aakar, uh, this is 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 this there and hence it is correct. It's a Sarvanadi Sarvanadi. So 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 she she did uh, uh, war uh, with uh, with Mahishasura. Mahishasura. That's why Mahishasura. Okay. Saha, uh, whenever we use saha, the uh, corresponding word is Sir one doubt sir here in the beginning. Yes. yes. त्रिमूर्ति नाम इतरेशम विद रिस्पेक्ट टू दिस नाउ इफ इट इज त्रिमूर्ति नाम एंड अदर्स और राइट देयर कुड बी अ केस अदर देन त्रिमूर्ति नाम सो हाउ इज द एंड इंटरप्रेटेड इंटरप्रेटेड इन बिटवीन त्रिमूर्ति नाम एंड इतरेशम सो त्रिमूर्ति नाम सो त्रिमूर्ति नाम अंशैहि इतरेशम च देवानाम अंशैहि दैट इज हाउ इट हैज टू बी इंटरप्रेटेड so trimurtis and other deva devatas itaresham cha but, but supposing the the meaning to be conveyed was other than trimurti naam then what would come in between trimurti naam and itaresha um so then uh, in that case uh, trimur so then what will happen is uh, trimurti itara trimurte tara uh, sorry, trimurti itara devana that would have been the way you would have uh, you would have come, conveyed it. so but in this case uh, along with trimurtis um as well as other as well as other gods that's how that is the interpretation of this text or trimurti bhinnanam devanam 
so that would be another way to say uh, other than trimurti okay trimurti bhinna naam deva naam amshaihi oh yes okay sir thank you that's how it would be okay yeah so simharudha bhutva bhutva stvantaviyam yuddham akarot yuddham dvitiya bhakti ekavachanam akarot sa yuddham akarot sa kena saha yuddham akarot sa devi mahishasurena sa yuddham akarot katham katham yuddham akarot simharudha bhutva yuddham akarot okay so this will be the answers that we can get next navadina paryantam yuddham abhavat so the uh, the लास्टेड फॉर नईन डेज नव दिन पर्यत ओके नईन डेज पर्यत पर्यत मीन अंटिल ओके मीनिंग ऑफ दट युद्ध अभवत दिस ऑल स्ट्रेट फॉर्वर्ड आई एम नॉट रईटिंग इट इस प्रथम पुरुष एक वचन इट्स इन लग्लकार दशमे दिन ऑन द टेन्त डे दशमे दिन सप्तमी एक वचन देवी महिषासुर संहार अकोत शी डिड The samhara of the Mahishasura. Etasya ha ghatana ya ha. So samharam is again Vidya Bhakti ek vachanam. Akarot is Pratham Purusha ek vachanam. Etasya ha ghatana ya ha. Smaran artham to remember. Okay, or in remembrance of this episode or or this event. Etasya ha ghatana ya ha. Ghatana is akara and the Sriling Shabda and hence etasya ha shishti ek vachanam and ghatana ya ha shishti ek vachanam. स्मरणार्थम टू रिमेम्बर द पर्पस इज टू रिमेम्बर नवरात्रोत्सव आचरती पीपल पीपल सेलेब्रेट नवरात्रोत्सव सो जना नवरात्रोत्सव आचरती ओके सो दिस इज द्वितीय भक्ति एक वचन दिस इज प्रथम पुरुष बहुवचन दशमे दिन विजयोत्सव आचरती ऑन द टेन्थ डे ओके ऑन द टेन्थ डे अगेन सप्तम एक वचन विजयोत्सव आचरती So, Dvitiya Bhakti, one more time, Acharanti, first of all, celebrate the victory. Yeah, they celebrate the victory on the tenth day. The same day, Vijayot Sabam Acharanti. This is how uh, the meaning of these sentences. Hope it's clear. Thank you, Madam Satyajit Mohanty. Ulrich Mohanty, and uh, uh, please read the next set of sentences one by one. Ulrich Mohanty, you can read. Dinesh Shah. अयमेव उत्सव उत्तर भारत राम से विजय संकेत तया आचर्य अत एव इदम पर्व रामलीला इति च प्रसिद्ध अस्ति उत्तम गुप्ता महोदय प्लीज रिटर्न एक सेंटेंस कैन यू हियर मी मे बी यू आर ऑन म्यूट और देयर सम इशू इन योर सिस्टम ओके शांता भगिनी प्लीज रीड द नेक्स्ट सेंटेंस हरिओम महोदय हरिओम महेशः विजयोत्सवस्य अबरम नाम विजयदशमी इति विद्यारम्भाय एतद् दिनं प्रशस्तम इति कथयन्ति अस्मिन् दिने सीमोल्लंघनं शमीवृक्षस्य पूजा च कुर्वन्ति उत्तमं नाउ लेट अस अंडरस्टैंड दिस अयमेव उत्सवः this festival only ayam eva so eva again we are using it as uh, for only to get the meaning of only uttara bharate in north india uttara bharate saptami ekavachanam ramasya vijaya sanketataya ramasya shishti ekavachanam vijaya sanketataya vijaya sanketata is the word taya so vijaya sanketataya okay okay so uh, sanketam meaning uh, a symbol symbolizing or something like that okay so vijaya sanketam vijaya sanketam means the to symbolize uh, the victory the victory okay uh, so ramasya vijaya sanketataya aacharyate uh, so by symbolizing the victory of rama they celebrate this festival or this festival is being celebrated by them आचर्यते as i said it is again in the passive voice which for pratham purusha ek vachanam utsavah aacharyate ata eva atah eva there is a visarga lopa uh, idam parva ramalila iti cha prasiddham asti see now parva prasiddham asti if it was utsavah prasiddha asti uh, as we saw in the previous sentences now you can um, correlate and understand it in full so idam parva or uh, this is all in um, um uh, prathama purusha ekavachanam 
प्रसिद्धम अस्ति ओके दिस इज फेमस एज रामलीला आल्सो नेक्स्ट महेश विल अगेन से विजयोत्सवस्य अपरन नाम विजयदशमी इति द नेम ऑफ दिस विक्टरी और द सेलिब्रेशन ऑफ दिस विक्टरी इज आल्सो कॉल्ड विजयदशमी बिकॉज इट्स अ टेंथ डे एंड इट इज यूज्ड टू सेलिब्रेट और इट इज सिंबलाइजिंग द विक्टरी इट इज कॉल्ड विजयदशमी ओके अपरम नाम इट्स ऑल इन प्रथम प्रथम भक्ति एक वचन मोंदी विजयोत्सवस्य विजय उत्सवस्य विजयोत्सवस्य गुण संधि एंड षष्टी भक्ति एक वचन विद्यारंभाय कैन यू आइडेंटिफाई व्हिच विभक्ति दिस इज चतुर्थी चतुर्थी विभक्ति एक वचन वेरी गुड विद्यारंभाय टू बिगिन लर्निंग और द विद्याभ्यासस्य आरंभार्थम ओके आरंभः इज बिगिनिंग सो एनी न्यू knowledge or any new uh, learning that we want to do if we do it on vijayadashmi it will be successful that is based on a tradition and based on um uh, 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 the facts that have been given in the puranas etc we we can know that vidyarambhaya etad dinam etad dinam nama vijayadashmi dinam prashastam iti kathayanti prashastam is excellent to to start any learning on vijayadashmi is really excellent prashastam iti kathayanti this is what people say कथयति जनाः कथयति प्रथम पुरुषा बहुवचनं प्रशस्तम इज एक्सेलेंट अस्मिन दिने सीमोल्लंघनं शमी वृक्षस्य पूजा च कुर्वन्ति अस्मिन दिने ऑन दिस डे सीमोल्लंघनं सीमोल्लंघनं इज बेसिकली टू क्रॉस अ बॉर्डर क्रॉस अ रिवर एटसेट्रा एनी ऑफ दीस थिंग्स इज कॉल्ड एज सीमोल्लंघनं सीमा इज बेसिकली अ बॉर्डर ओके और अ कन्फाइनमेंट सो यूजुअली ऑन द 9 डेज मोस्ट ऑफ द पीपल stay in only one place or uh, usually uh, some of the yatis also stay uh, near the river banks and they do their anushthanam etc and they won't go anywhere outside during the first 9 uh, days and on the 10th day they will do this uh, ritual called simolanganam that is to cross uh, the border or cross a uh, river etc so simolanganam and then shami vrikshasya puja shami shami there is a it's a, a tree and uh, the puja of that tree is actually being done on this day so uh, this shami vriksha also has a lot of significance and lot of historical uh, importance so shami shamayate papam there is one shloka also that is being chanted when uh, the puja of shami vriksha is being done and the shami leaves are also given to others uh, in 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 a good um, um uh, okay. say uh, as a good wish uh, that is it, it's given so shami shamayate papam um, and then uh, also there is a significance related to mahabharata where arjuna arjunasya dhanudhari so he, he he would have kept his weapons and everything on a shami vriksha so there is also another significance that is there and through that only they obtained the vijaya so that is the meaning and that is the significance of this so shishti bhakti ekavachanam puja cha kurvanti kurvanti pratham purusha bahu vachanam janaha puja kurvanti hope all these words are clear We shall proceed for the धन्यवादा हा उदित महोदया and शांता भगिनी धन्यवादा महोदया okay let us see the last set of sentences um, okay Radha Krishnan महोदया and uh, uh, Venkata Kupaswami महोदया please read the next set of sentences one by one हर राम राम महोदया राम राम दिनेश दिनेश अस्य विरामस्य उपयोग चीतनाय अभवत् अस्य विराम योग समीचीनतया अभवत् हां राधा कृष्ण महोदय प्लीज रीड द नेक्स्ट सेंटेंस येशु दिनेश महेशः येशु दिनेशो गतवर्ष गतवर्षेहं मैसूर नगर नगर मग अगच्छत मैसूरपुरी तर दिनेश शोभन अधुना समय अभवत इतः परम प्रतिदिन क्रीडाभ्यागमिष्या पुनः मिलावग शुभम भवतु ओके इन द लास्ट सेंटेंस राधा कृष्ण महोदय महेश है धन्यवाद है शुभम भवतु ते शुभम भवतु ते उत्तम 
uh, Priyarashni Bhagini join a discussion. Let us try to understand these sentences. And uh, this is the last set of sentences of this lesson. Uh, probably in the next uh, three to four minutes, we should be able to cover this. Asya Niramasya Upayogaha Samichina Taya Abhavata. Samichina Taya. Samichina Taya in a best possible way. Samichinam is good or uh, uh, anything that is worthy, etc. That is what is Samichinam. So Asya Viramasya Nama Navaratra Viramasya Dasara Viramasya Upayogaha. Uh, the vacation was used or uh, was uh, 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 we, we, we made a good use of this vacation. That is the meaning of this. Shashti Eka Vachanam Viramasya Upayogaha Samichinataya Abhavata in a good way. Samichinataya again Samichinata and this is Tritya Bhakti Eka Vachanam. Pratama Purusha Eka Vachanam. Next Mahesha will say Eshu Dineshu Gatavar Sheham Sandhi. Purva Rupa Sandhi. Very good. Gata Aham Purva Rupa Sandhi. Gata during the last year. Okay, Gata Varshe. Gata is whichever has elapsed or which has gone. In the, in the last year, I had been to Mysuru Nagaram. Mysuru Nagaram Agacham. Aham Mysuru Nagaram Agacham. Agacham. So it's Uttama Purva Rupa Sandhi. Mahishura Puri Iti Tasya Nagarasya Puratana Nama. The olden, older name of this uh, or the ancient name of this place, Mysuru, is Mahishuru Mahishura Puri. So Nama uh, Nagara Pura, all these are equivalent words. Mahishura Nagaram, also you can say. Okay. Mahishura. So again, here, uh, why, why this, this, uh, this name came is because Mahisha Mahishasura. Is there. So based on that, Mahishura Puri, that's how it is. Uh, it was named actually. Iti Tasya Nagarasya Puratana Nama. Tasya Nagarasya Nama, Mysuru Nagarasya Puratana Nama. Shashti Vakti Puratana Nama. Okay. Uh, after he said this, Dinesha, Dinesha will say, Shobhanam. Okay, uh, let good happen. Shobhanam. Good. Us too. Adhuna Samayaha Bhavat. Now that it's time. So even for our class. So Adhuna Samayaha Bhavatam. Itaf param pratirinam krida bhyasartham agamishyami. So uh, itaf param from henceforth, okay, now on or uh, henceforth, I shall come to play every day. Pratidinam krida bhyasartham agamishyami. I shall come to play every day. Okay, krida bhyasartham, krida bhyasartham, krida yaha abhyasartham. Krida Abhyasa, there is a Savanadirga Sandhi, Krida and Abhyasa. And then there's one more Artha. Okay. So for the purpose of practicing this game, I shall come every day. Agamishyami, Aham Agamishyami, Uttama Purusha, Ekotam. Rittakaraha. Yes, Bhavishit Kala. Punaha Milavaha. Let us meet again. Let both of us will meet again, maybe tomorrow. Shubham Bhavatu. Let good happen. So he will just wish him. Uh, bye and he will leave uh, so Dinesha and same way Mahesh will also say Thanyavadaha Shubham Bhavatu Te uh, let also good happen to you as well so Shubham Bhavatu Te Te is here uh, what is that it is not Sahatau Te but it is Tubhyam Te Te Shubham Bhavatu okay so this is not uh, Tat Shabda but it is yush, uh, Yushma Shabda and Chaturthi Bhakti Ekavachana very good, very good. Lot lakaraha, Madhyama Purusha, sorry, uh, Pratama Purusha Ekavachan. Bhavatu is uh, uh, Shubham Bhavatu. So he is telling, for you, let Shubham happen. So it is Pratama Purusha Ekavachan Mohundi. So this way, uh, the beautiful conversation between two friends, Mahesha and Dinesha, about Navaratra Uttava, how it, it was celebrated in Kolkata and how it is being celebrated in Mysore. And what are um, the various other names that, that are uh, used to um, uh, refer to Navaratra Utsava, everything we learned in this lesson, and also a few grammar points and able to understand the meaning of the sentences and uh, Vishesha Prayoga of the Kridanta words and the Kriyapadas, all these things we were able to learn in this uh, uh, lesson. So, Dhanyavadaha uh, Venkat Mohodaya, Radha Krishna Mohodaya and uh, Prayada Bhagini. Hope uh, we are all able to understand this lesson. Uh, and uh, uh, my request again uh, is to uh, please write down the lesson and do the translation of this lesson completely. Okay, so that will give you a good uh, confidence, and uh, you will be able to uh, kind of.